What's going on, y'all? Let me just tell you this. That sometimes when you're waiting on God and the waiting seems to be very long, you can sometimes get in an ungrateful state, in an unthankful state, because you're waiting for God to do something that he said while neglecting everything that he's ever did for while neglecting who he is we thank god for who he is not for what he does we thank god we thank god that there is a god that he is god and that he sent us jesus that's enough to be thankful your thankfulness shouldn't be predicated on what God has done or didn't do you know but oftentimes I'm being I'm being transparent and honest with you oftentimes you can get into a spot where you don't want to thank God you know you you can get in a spot where you thank God but it's like you you waiting you waiting and it's like god has left you you know it's like god not responding but you still have to be thankful i'm talking about when you in the midst when you in this waiting season it can get to you sometimes the bible says in everything give thanks it's hard to give thanks in that sometimes is what i'm trying to tell you in your waiting, in your long suffering, it's hard to give thanks. That's nothing more than praise, the fruit of your lips. That's how we praise the Lord. By, by, by entering his courts with thanksgiving. His gates with praise. Okay, so when you're going through sometimes, it's, it's hard to thank God. I was sitting here singing that song, Thank You, Lord. You know, thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, you, Lord. Oh, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And I just want to say thank you lord sometimes we can't do it because we mad we pissed off we sad you know we vexed in our spirit and sometimes we can't say thank you okay sometimes we can't say thank you so i thought i'd come on here to encourage you and let you know to still thank god in spite of you know thank god in spite of he knows your feelings, cast your cares onto him because he cares for you. You know, he knows, you know, that you're upset, that you're tired. He knows everything that you have need of. But he wants you to know that he is still God. And for that reason, you still have a reason to thank him. Thank him for giving you breath and life. You know, thank God for salvation and glory. Thank God for heaven. Thank God for your name being written in the Lamb's Book of Life. You know, thank God that you you have a second chance. You have a chance right now to come boldly to the throne, accepting the grace and choosing Jesus Christ. Thank God for that. Because some people didn't wake up this morning. You know. Be blessed, y'all.